What's up, Fortnite streamers, dude? We're back with more Fortnite. This is chapter three. I just have it before everyone. Okay, don't worry about it, because I'm cool. I added Scopeland's Togekiss, because I'm a scumbag. Oh, I can finally play, right? Because shout out to my boy, the coronavirus. My man, right? Shut down school. I can't play at school, because the Wi-Fi messes it up. So, here we are. We're gaming. Um, so, Togekiss, Lapras are like the only things I haven't used before, I think. Uh, Lapras is G-Max for the screens, weakness policy because it's bulky. Togekiss is, you know, casual scum set. And then I got Alley Switch on Rotom, Fake Tears Whimsicott. Only one physical attacker? We're gonna see how that goes, so we're gonna find some games. I've not played any this season because I haven't been able to, so let's get it. Searching for a game. I played, you know, I played a couple because I wanted to see how the team works, and uh, it took me two games to remember to Dynamax Candy. And it cost me literally both times, so that one really hurts a lot. Okay, this is fun. Let's see. Probably Duraludon. I mean, he's going to lead with a, um, a super fun trick room setup, right? Which isn't horrible. I mean, I have a lot of slow things. Duraludon's really good for any lead, honestly. Um... Other than Conk, but I don't really see him leading Conk. Togekiss? I like Duraldon Togekiss. I think I can big mode Togekiss and then hit him with the uh, Duraldon. He'll probably want to fake out the Togekiss if I had to guess. Hmm, now let's see what else. Probably this fella. He only gets hit by Conk. Um, so what am I going to do about the conk is the question. I don't think I can really do anything. I think I'm just bringing Rotom. We're going to see how it goes. Not bringing my boy conk. The question is, what is he going to fake out? Assuming he leads Incineroar Dusclops, which I feel like is coming. Probably happening. Hmm... What will it be? Lapras Alchemy. Okay, I don't actually know anything about the game. Don't listen to me. I don't know anything. Oh, I don't like the spot that I'm in. Togekiss is getting ice moved. And nothing wants to take it. Fake out Dazzling Gleam. There's no need to follow me. I think I'm just going for damage. I think I'm... Yeah. Just going for damage sounds right. I don't think he can get the double KO. I can get some good damage in here before he gets his screens up with his Lapras. And I can come in with mine a little bit later. And stagger out my screens. So that might give me the advantage, hopefully. I'll just get some damage off. Try to survive his Dynamax or his Gigantamax here. See what happens. He's large? But he's not purple, which means he's not as good. Just be purple and you're better at the game. Everyone knows that. Alchemy, that was a good hit. Crit, baby. Decorate. I don't know what that move does, but I'm scared. Attack, special attack. That's it? That's busted. Just a free buff? Yeah, I'm definitely losing Togekiss. It's so dead. It's so dead. Duraludon. Interesting. My boy's gone. Let's see. What can I do here? I think I can go into Rotom. I think I like, to be honest, ally switch shenanigans. I think I like that. Just to get some damage off while I can. I think I just ally switch Dazzling Gleam. Because he's going to ice move the Togekiss. And he doesn't have... What do you call it? He doesn't have freeze dry because he's big mode. So I think this is my play. 
We're gonna see how it goes. I don't like that I have to find a way to get up my own screen so when he's plus two. He's gonna have a scope and so kiss. That's gonna hurt. It's not gonna feel good for my Lapras at all. I also don't really have anything to hit it with. All right, I'm really betting on him uh, ice moving into the token kiss slot. That was really the play here, or the goal here for me. Okay. Crit, right now. We need it, now more than ever. Oh, that did half of a damage to him. Good work. Okay, I was going to say, if he predicted that, he's just probably the greatest in the world. That's a lot of damage. I'm special defensive Rotom. That's a lot of damage. There's two turns, three turns left. Okay, awesome. Very fun. So I'm going to Dazzling Gleam. And we're just going to go out. Um, this is plus two, so it's going to be the threat. That's scary. You know, the Dazzling Gleam just go out into the uh, Togekiss. I'm really hoping that my Rotom can take a hit from the Togekiss here. If not, I'm probably just... Okay, yeah, Rotom took that really well. I'm really not happy about all the free damage he's getting off. This is bad. The whole uh, boosted special attack by two is pooping on my face right now. All right, I'll remember you, Togekiss. You fought valiantly. Oh my gosh, Lapras is gonna have to one v three these, dude. I don't think I don't see this working out for me at all, in any circumstance. Straight up not good for me. I have to ally switch and get up screens. That's like actually the only play. And I think Togekiss probably protects. He's shown that he has it. I think he protects here, but on the off chance he doesn't, it's the only way I think I win. I think that's my out. Togekiss protects here and he targets the Rotom slot with the freeze dry. And it's not going to feel good for sure. He's plus two. He's probably faster. I won't get my screens up until afterwards. But I don't really see any other any other out here, you know. We're gonna see what happens. I'm going for it. I believe. I believe. It's a lot of HP. My screens are staggered. It's not the worst thing I've ever seen in my life. Right, dazzling gleam then. Oh, Rotom has to survive. Oh. We must be speed tight. I don't have any speed investment. Either that or he has a negative speed nature. Alright, got Togekiss. Now, what did Lapras do is the question. If you target down the Rotom slot, it's probably over. Weakness policy? Yeah, but I don't really know if I could have done anything else. Like, what do I do, honestly? Alright, well, Rotom's dead. Remember me, Rotom. I could have max geysered in the rain, but like, I should have max geysered in the rain. Not to set up weakness policy. Yeah. I should have. Yeah. Because if I ally switch, he's not hitting the Rotom anyway, so then he still survives. Yeah, I threw. That's a throw. We threw those. Hard throwing. Hmm. Now he just probably freeze dries Rotom. Unless he predicts the ally switch and he freeze dries in. Well, no, it doesn't matter. Because Togekiss is going to pick up the KO, so we'll see what happens, I guess. Follow me. Volt switch. Oh man, doesn't pick up the KO. That's really unfortunate. If he was trying to play around ally switch and he went into the Lapras, this is still winnable. Definitely a bad spot to be in, but it's not over. Parish Song. Okay, that's a bad spot to be in. But oh, we gotta kill him in three turns. It's winnable though. I have two. It's winnable. 
Okay. Mm That's a move, isn't it? Depends on what he has in the back, and if it has protect or not, it's Cinnaroar. And Cinnaroar's not gonna run protect, right? Why would he? There's no way. No way he's running protect. He can't fake out that, so I'm gonna hit him with that. We're gonna go into the Lapras. He's just gonna fake out Rotom, but I mean, I don't see any point in ally switching. The only thing I can, if I ally switch, right, then um, Lapras takes like four damage, but Rotom doesn't do anything, so what's the point, you know? Might as well just let Rotom take it and go for the kill on the Incineroar. That's my thoughts anyway. I don't know if that's right, but that's what we're doing here. I was also kind of thinking the Lapras might protect, but alas, he did not. He survives that with the screens. Ouch. And he's got a berry. Yeah, there's nothing I can do. He, he's too bulky. The screens are going. It's not good for me. I guess I should have alley switched. I'm going to live the freeze right myself, Rotom. I made a lot of misplays this game. Man, it's going to be tough getting back into it. I made a lot of misplays. I don't have weakness policy yet. There's nothing I can do. Um, if I had killed that last turn, if I'd killed the Incineroar, let's see, ally switch, then I live, then I st the Incineroar still lives, but then I guess I get to hit him again. I don't know. I don't know. It's questionable. With that miss, it's over. Hmm. I definitely misplayed a lot. Um, setting off the weakness policy didn't end up mattering. Oh man. Alright, well I die after next turn. I can't kill them both, so. It's been real. Definitely off to a rough start this season. You hate to see that. It's a rough one. Definitely some misplays. Hmm. Duraludon getting murked right at the beginning was in probably not the best play for me. I just didn't really think it was happening, to be fair. I thought he was going for the Tokus. I don't know. I mean, it worked out, so I guess it's the right target, but I'm not sure which one is actually the right target there. We're going to keep battling. We're going to slide all the way down to Pokeball tier at this rate, man. Big struggle over here. Hmm. My team's really slow, too. I mean, I guess it didn't really matter the last game. I was faster. He just played better. I don't know. The Alchemy boost was crazy, man. I did not see that coming. Never seen that before. Hmm. That, I was just never able to deal with the Lapras. The Lapras sat on the field from turn one and just kind of dunked on me. Trick room. Groudon hits everything. Literally everything here. Um, let's see, what's the lead here? I'm thinking we're out on Togekiss. Togekiss does well here. What else we got? Hmm. I like Lapras again. Lapras is cool. And then the question is, Whimsicott or Rotom? Rotom gets dumpstered by the dragon he's got there. And Energy Ball. So probably Whimsicott just for fake tier support, I guess. Um, Moonblast doesn't hurt. I mean, it hits too super effectively, so I got that going for me. Tailwind is going to be a non-factor against the Trick Room team. So we're going to see how this goes. Um, I, don't, hmm, I don't know. Should be good. I haven't got Lapras to work yet. Just need to be better, lol. Maybe if I was better, I could have won some more games. It's a classic maybe if I was better moment. My eyes itchy, dude. You know, pick your team, Beck. Let's go. Let's get it. I'm ready. Nice. Three seconds to spare.
I feel like the cards are different. I feel like my card is not the same as it used to be, but it should be, right? I don't know, I don't know man. I haven't played in a month. Surprised I haven't seen a Venusaur yet. Fake out. That makes me think that Togekiss is going to get the fake out here. So I want to Dynamax Togekiss. I'm pretty sure Togekiss is going to get fake out right now. Reuniclus can hit me with the... Uh... Quite a spooky trick room. I think that's what he's doing. He's going to fake out Togekiss' trick room. I'm calling it. Large Burb. Get in there. Large Reuniclus is not trick rooming. Yeah, we're just going for it. That's terrifying. Reuniclus is a problem. Yo, look at that mouth, dude. He's big, and I'm scared. Fake out Tokus. Oh, we did it. Nice. Alright, now, next airstream will make me speedy. I don't know how speedy. I kind of doubt that I outspeed the Weavile, but you never know. Maybe. Drawdown's definitely gonna hit. Ooh, that does good damage. Lost some of his HP. Alright, Drawdown survived, so that's. Oh my gosh! Woo, dude, that's insane! Wow. We're going to hit him with a Dark Pulse. I think I'm going to protect Togekiss. Because I feel like Weavile is still faster. Like, that thing's so fast, it's insane. Interesting. Double Max Guard, what do you do? He's Ice Sharded. I don't think Ice Shard does it for him. I think he does outspeed me, to be honest, but. That won't be enough. Like, I don't think Ice Shard's gonna... Ooh, 67 HP. Actually, it might. Yeah, I feel like we're switching out, right? I don't really want to lose Togekiss. Like... I think I can pick up the KO on Reuniclus. I don't feel like I need to lose Togekiss. For no reason, right? Because I think I died. 67 HP. So I'll save him. Yeah, there's the Ice Shard. Now it's a matter of does Dark Pulse kill. Which I think it does. It'll be close. Nice. Alright, cool. A crit! I wonder if that mattered. I still don't know because I thought it would be really close without a crit. So who knows, man? Either way, maybe if you're better, you don't get crit if you're just better at the game. Lol, it's easy. Just be better. That's the way I see it. When I get crits, because I'm not good enough, dude, just be better. I'm sure Weavile has Sash, which isn't very cool. Runerigus. Runerigus. Rune uh, okay. Epic. Is he gonna trick room? I'm still just Dark Pulsing away, man. And I'm going to freeze dry, because if Yali switches, then it's whatever. At least uh, we have a double resist. But I still think I have to double up into Rinnerigus. Uh Ally switch is like a minor annoyance, but I don't know if I care, to be honest. I don't think I do. Brick break. Oof. Yeah, he's not too happy about that one. Arunarius is going to get dunked on right now. Plus two Ice Shard coming at you, dude. 
I mean, not now, obviously, but you know if I need it later. What's he got? Jail Scent? Jail Scent would be good. That would be good to see. Yo! Yo, oh, he brought Jail Scent. Ooh, actually, terrain's up. So we're gonna hit him with a Thunderbolt. And then a freeze dry. Jelson's not really run protect, so I think it's safe to just double up on it and not worry about it. Ooh, Lapis lives those, buddy. He has the electric berry. Interesting. I did not expect that at all. He was paralyzed. He's paralyzed. Yo, Thunderbolt's the same. What a move. And he's gone. It's been real. Peace out. Freeze Dry seems kind of busted as a move in general. This is really good. And then this thing should just go down to an Ice Shard and a thing. What do you call it? I know what it's called. Oh, he left. There he's out. Yeah, that goes down to an Ice Shard and then um, Flash Cannon. Lit. Nice. Uh, wait, no, I didn't want to check. I don't really care. Wait, I'm assuming he had Trick Room. Yeah. And then Trick Room again. Yeah. Three Trick Roomers, dude. He brought three out of four of them. I'm not going to continue battling. Uh, that's going to be it for this video, but I'm going to go... You know, we're, we're self-quarantined over here. We're going to try to go every day of the week, Monday through Friday. So smash subscribe for more trash. You know, me being bad on the ladder. Maybe one day I'll build a team, but until then, peace out.